Thank you, thank you, thank you. 20 years, we've been here 20 years. We never, we never imagined that when we first started. Uh, well, we thought, you know, we were, we loved ministry, we loved serving the Lord, we wanted to uh, do things to help people. But we never knew when we started this organization that it was going to grow. And it's, it's become bigger and we're stronger than ever. And we're looking forward to the future. And we couldn't do this without you guys being here doing this. So we really thank you for that. But some people want to know why, why what makes you strong? What makes, makes you hang in there to keep doing it over and over and over again, year after year? And it's looking into the kids' faces. When you look into the eyes of the kids... And you see they're special. They care. They're loving. They're respectful. I mean, I mean, these kids that they, they love the attention and with a little bit of guidance, they can they can and are accomplishing great things. eyes of these kids in these communities and we saw the ones that were hurting. These are the ones that do not attend programs, but they're out there and they were looking for somebody, somebody to care and look into their eyes. So Steve and I and Debbie, we started the journey and we had no money, but we just kept persevering and we had a lot of people that rolled their eyes at us and said, you go where? Why do you do that? But every time we heard the naysayers, the ones rolled their eyes, boy, I'll tell you what, we got more determined, rolled up our sleeves, pulled up our bootstraps, and we kept going out there looking in the eyes of those kids. And I am so grateful to God. And I gotta tell you, truly, it's a miracle. It's a miracle that we're standing here. It's a miracle that God gave, has given us 20 years. I can't believe it. And when I look at that video, and I look at where we are today, seeing it strong, truly, it's amazing. understand when you say 20 years of sweat, blood, tears. They literally are saving lives. They went into communities where people are not going into the communities and they see these people and they give them opportunities that other people have discarded or written off. I don't think people understand how big that is.